Our show from the new film Hitman, Hitman Agent 47, Zachary Quinto would be here. And the, the two finalists in Lions Search for America's new grill star will go head to head mm. in the final cookoff to determine the $10,000 winner. Yeah. $10,000. Ten thousand dollars. We grilling. have all these judges, and they get their own like webisode shows. Oh, really? And we get to eat. Yes. So it better be it. great. I get to eat tomorrow. ABC's correspondent Sarah Haynes will be my co-host, and I will graduate from summer school after she gives me a lesson in basketball drills. Wow. Yeah. wow. All right. Listen, she plays country superstar Raina James on the hit ABC series Nashville. Please. Welcome the wonderful and talented Connie Britton. Now, you guys, do you know each other? Yeah, we're friends. Yeah, oh. we're friends. Do you ever work together? <laughs> yeah. Yes. And, 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 and here's what's funny. Neither yeah. one of us can really remember what it was. <laughs> I it's literally not true. It's not true. I can, I can remember. Oh, okay, good. Me too. Uh, <laughs> well, what I really what I really remember was it was a very short-lived show on ABC called Life As We Know It. And Life, Con Life As We Know It. Life As We Know It. <laughs> guest stars on it. So right. we weren't like regulars on the show. No, I was only on it one time. I think I was only on it twice. Yes. And, um, but we did fly back from Vancouver together on the same flight and we sat together. We bonded. We bonded. And I remember, you really actually helped me because I was at a point in my career where I was like nervous about what was going to happen next. And you were just like, you know, the career takes different paths. <laughs> and this is like, what I, I don't know what it was exactly that you said, but then I remember like four years later, you are on Friday Night Lights and I was like, oh, no, she knows what she's talking about. <laughs> I'm going to listen to her. <laughs> I'm so glad yeah. to hear that. I'm yeah. so smart. You are. I'm you are. I'm so smart. You really are. And, and last time I saw you was at the White House, the East End yeah. Road. So cool. And, and we are, this is so live. Fun. Oh, that's the Jacqueline um, Kennedy Garden. Now, yeah, did, there, did, there did, we were, we're just in the Kennedy Garden. Not a big deal. Yeah, no big deal. Did you yeah. have a good time at the White House? Oh, I had the best time. Did you take anything? You still eat anything? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I, I don't know what I thought you meant, but I have a bunch of napkins at home. I'm not ashamed. I'm not going to tell you about right. it. Let's be clear. Right. On national I television. I have, I have napkins. Secret Service, come and find me. Cut to knock, knock, knock. Um, you went to Africa this summer. I did. I went to Africa this summer for two weeks um, with the UN because I'm oh, a UN Goodwill ambassador. That's amazing. Um, so we went to Kenya and Rwanda, and I took my son Yobi. Oh. For, it was the first time. How old that is he's Yobi been back now? There. He's four and a half. I can't believe that. So, I know. So did he enjoy it? Did oh, he have look a good at time? him. He had an amazing time. It was really incredible. And you know, it wasn't. So it wasn't one of those things where he got there and he was like, oh, my home. You know, it wasn't like that. Yeah. But it was just. It was a really great trip, and he. Took it all in, and it was. I, I love being there with him. And, and so, do you plan on going back? Oh yeah. What's yeah, that we'll flight like with a four-year-old? He's he's amazing. He really? Was, yeah. It's the iPad, man. <laughs> it's the only time that he doesn't ever get to watch the iPad. It's his special plane iPad, uh -huh. and so when he's on the plane, it does does the trick. I remember yeah. when Birdie was very little. Krista Miller, who was on Cougar Town with me, said before a big trip. Do not let them see any television or iPads for four days before. Yeah. And then they get on the airplane and they're like, you, ne you don't hear from them. It's true. <laughs> it's really kind Sorry, of Sorry, guys, amazing. that's my parenting tip. Parenting. I don't know if it's great. I'm just saying I like a book. I like yeah. my Oprah magazine. Exactly. Listen, this if is, I don't hear from him the whole trip, then <laughs> job done. This is Parenting 2015, everybody. Sorry, guys. All right, we got to take a quick break. We're going to have more with Connie Britton when we come back, so stay right there. American Ultra. Um, this, this film is it's wild. It's wild. It's, it's wild. Funny. Yeah, it's I watched action. it. It's a, you did. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Did and like I'm it? working with Walton Goggins right oh, now. He's, he's so talented. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So are you, Connie? Oh well, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
<laughs> so how would you me. describe this film, though? This film is so fun because it's it's really unusual. It's not like no. your normal run-of-the-mill. First and foremost, it's funny. So yeah. just go see it if you feel like laughing. Mm -hmm. But it also, um, it's kind of like stoners meets <laughs> the Bourne identity. <laughs> right, exactly. That's a great way to describe it. at all, yes. right? Don't and you think? Yes, and you play CIA agent Lassiter. Yes, now, is, she, is she good? Is she bad? There are good guys and bad guys in this movie. She Well, it's a mystery. Yeah. That's the thing. There are a lot of misleads in the movie. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, you'll have to go to the movie to find out if she's good or she's bad. Yeah, <laughs> there's lots of surprises. But it was a really fun role for me and, and kind of a, a different role for me than anything I've ever done before. There are lots of action and, you know, and it all takes place in one day, right. really. Mm -hmm. um, which was actually funny because it also meant there was just one costume. But that's got to be easy. I know Nashville. Yeah, you, have you think it'd be and so easy. You think it'd be easy. great to wear one thing. Except that I go from I go on this journey where I'm all like clean to where at the end where I'm just yeah. a, a wreck. So there were actually four different versions, at least four different versions of the costume. But the worst part was we shot the movie last year in New Orleans last summer. Okay. And for whatever masochistic reason, the director was like, I want you wearing a turtleneck. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. For your one costume in the movie. Did they have like, to just, in between takes, come in and dab the sweat off of you? Yeah, but like, literally, oh, just, just the sweat off of me. But, um, but he, he made a good point, which actually turned out to be true, which is, in New we shot a lot at night. He said, you're going to be thanking me because when you got that turtleneck on and the killer mosquitoes are attacking, <gasps> you'll have some protection. And he was Wrong. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Okay, well, yeah. we're gonna. Director knows best. Uh, yeah, he does. Yes. We're gonna take a, a look at a clip, and in this scene, Agent Lasseter attempts to activate Mike, who's the stoner cash and carry clerk, back into the CIA super assassin that he once was. So take a look. <laughs> I think he was having a little bit too much fun before um, you came in and spoke to him. Yeah. And the movie is American Ultra, it's in theaters Friday, August 21st. Give it up for one of our favorites. Connie Britton, everybody.